On April 1st, SpaceX's Starship Super Heavy Booster, 14 began its journey from Mega Bay 1 at Starbase, Texas, to the launch pad. This Super Heavy Booster, the first to be reused after its successful flight on Flight 7, was transported along Highway 4 to Pad A for upcoming tests. Booster 14 was moved out of Mega Bay 1, where it underwent repairs and refitting following its last mission. SpaceX teams used cranes to position the booster onto its transporter, marking the start of its trip to the orbital launch mount. The short journey took it from the production site to the launch area, with no delays reported during the operation. At Pad A, Booster 14 was lifted onto the orbital launch mount, where it's now being prepared for a static fire test scheduled for Thursday, April 3rd. This test will fire its 33 Raptor engines, a critical step before its next flight. SpaceX has confirmed Booster 14's role as a reusable booster, a milestone in their Starship program. After its previous launch and recovery, it's set to support future missions. From Starbase, Texas, Booster 14's return to the pad signals ongoing progress in SpaceX's reusable rocket technology. The company continues to push forward with preparations for its next Starship launch.